thing we don't yeah. about it. Maybe just there is ma some magical SDI that just maybe you SDI up, you eat the suicide, or maybe it's just normal DI at the end of the day. Maybe maybe, maybe there's yeah. something we're missing. Some auto smash DI. Either That'd way, be pretty great. Either way, in, into our next set, losers quarterfinals: JW versus Eve, uh, previously known as Mistake. Man, that's not a Pokemon, but no. Yeah. But we're and, here. And uh, JW known by another name, <laughs> Lima Slayer. Lima Slayer. So this who is actually, was a Bayonetta. Hopefully that can help him out here. I mean, maybe in a few more months we're gonna see uh, Mistake Slayer. We don't know. We don't know. Either way, we could be seeing it tonight. Honestly, we could. We could. That's very possible. Now see, here's the thing. JW's always been good at living. Bayonetta combos. Yeah. Even in Smash 4. Well, in Smash 4, stronger. that's because he could just zip out yeah, with, he has his, the shadow with his cheat. Yeah, his, his cheat move. His little cheat button. His little hack. But, and uh, now Bayonetta doesn't even, have, doesn't even have those combos. And yeah. now he doesn't have to escape. <laughs> so yeah. Smash hasn't changed. It's not much. a lot easier. Not much has changed. Great maneuverability as a whole and you know, good avoidance on any kind of death combo for most characters. That's good been cross up at the back end. This is his combo, and JW responds with a back air. If I have to look at Smash 4, the thing that tilted JW the most was characters who just single hit moves that just did mad damage. You know, he always got mad against Cloud and, and some of those characters. The characters that had mad combos that kill you off the top or anything like that, he seemed to do well. Yeah, because those combos didn't exist on his character. Yeah. But in this game, I feel like those combos don't exist. Woo! Oh, nice deep, call hard out. call out. You nice thought you out. were fancy for clinging on that leg, thinking, oh, oh he's not going to see this side deep. That's such a JW thing to do. Yeah, exactly. No, just dare. He's good in weight. that piano. That's nice. Big yeah, this team is pretty Big great. Yeah. All right, 107 so far. Ooh. And then Ooh. that real quick, 2-2. Two, two, so. I mean, to me, he's been playing it well. I think he's, uh, he he's learned been. from his set against uh, uh, Brandon. He's learned a lot from that. Do you know if these guys have played yet in Ultimate? I actually don't know. I, I don't. I haven't, I haven't been keeping up with the weekly brackets that much. But I, I, I want to wager a guess of no. I think this I, might be their first encounter. I haven't heard JW talk about it at all. I oh, yeah. Like if JW beat him, he would be. Oh, for, oh, for sure. You would never it. hear the end of it. Oh, is that Ooh, dead? No, good his own wall fling. He's like, I can do it, too. Right, trying to find back to center stage right now. Sure, I'm not game. too sure why he's doing all that. Like pushing away with the water and shooting the trick. And he's kind of down in percent, and I feel like you I don't want to keep the ledge pressure going. I do say I do say that uh, shurikens are better in this game, but I agree. At this percent, you want to just kind of like find a way to actually just build percent and then go for the shuriken game. Just knowing that okay, I died. You're at 80. Doesn't matter. Well, there it is. Down smash of all moves. Might have been. Because of the clank, it clanks with hitboxes. Oh yeah! Might have been actually a big brain play. Maybe a big, big, a big brain play, or maybe right just swag. No, you know. Tamim loves disrespecting people. I, you know, it could have been a, a mix of both. No, it could have been both. Could have been both. Efficient and disrespectful, like Ganondorf. Yeah. <laughs> maybe on one of those. Either way. All right, good stuff. A lot of lag. You see the lag on that? Oh my god! Insane to see. I'm actually really surprised that Tamim is in the lead. That's not what I would have pegged at the yeah. start. Not because of his character, but more so, well, not because of him, but more so his character. Yeah, JW's been on fire. He's good at the Bayonetta matchup. Yeah. Oh, tries to read with a pivot grab to no avail, and then just nice anti punish. air. Definitely, uh, team could have gotten out of that. Might have gone for a greedy falling air or something. Tech, please, or something. Thank you, because the tech chase would have been gnarly. It would have been at 50. You know what I mean? I got to say, the wave lands, while they're not melee level, are very nice to see. Yeah. Very nice. Okay. Fair. And to me, it's just he's picking his moments really well to go in. I love how we're just playing neutral, and the music is like kind of like slowly but still going in. Less, regardless. You know, I think it's easier for bears up air to kill off the side than it is the top down. Yeah, I've, yeah. I've seen some combos. I've seen some bad DI in the up airs. Yeah. Then right to the blast zone. All right. Well, it does send outward. I can yeah. see that. Oh, greedy. Greedy read, 100%. Port back throw, yeah, okay. Like those types of reads don't really work on Tamim. He might die to a 4 throw here at the ledge. Just Put that careful. out there. Oh, for sure. One six Put that out there. Yeah. I don't know about that Nair, though. Even if you got that Nair and continue to be ledge trapping, it's still better to try to find oh. a kill. Oh, my. He might That's die. I think he's dead. Yeah. Barely. Wow. Barely. Wow. I got to say, the radar is really nice. You know, actually, don't look at the radar. Actually, I should. You're right. Really? Yeah, I yeah. like uh, to just see how close. Yeah, okay. Oh, you oh. might be dead. Air dodge on the flat. You're safe, actually. Down throw? Down throw, yeah. 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 Oh, At 200, that'll kill. 
from anywhere. All right, first go game goes to Tamim. Good. I mean, the, mo the moment he had a substantial lead, it was kind of like playing a keep away game, mm -hmm. and yeah. uh, well, uh, a keep up game. And GW was playing the keep away game for absolutely no reason. Yeah. You know, he kind of had to find a way in, get percent, and then play the keep away game. You know what I mean? Yeah, he was playing with. He's playing as if he had a lead. Yeah. But uh, none was to be seen at that at any point in that game, really. But you know, one thing I know about JW is that if something doesn't work, he's one of the few players who actually immediately changes it yes. in the game after. So smash fill. Oh, yeah, he's uh, good at adapting, but the one thing I don't like about the way he adapts is uh, to cut things out. Yeah, instead of just adding things. Doing, yeah, oh or, or mixing up the way he's using cre uh, current options. Ooh, damage. Right. I gotta be honest, guys. Are you pro or con Smasher? Uh, I'm definitely, I'm still pro, honestly. And apparently these guys are not, because in this region we do what run the heck? Hazard it's Smash Hazards on Smash Bowl. It's Hazards on, it's Hazards. Is that a mistake? Or? It's a hazardless Smash Bowl. Uh, they just don't know. This it's always. Like, I, I have this opinion: is that it's always the smartest of players screwing up, and everybody else is just for some reason not screwing yeah, up. Yeah, like me and Vishal earlier, for sure, the smartest of players. I commentated that. I was like, "You idiots!" <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, 96 so far. It's bound to happen. Yeah. And to follow up, mixed hazard skill sets. I'm pro. I mixed think they're hazard? not that hard. They're not. To deal with. Um, you just have to always be thinking about it, which is stressful. There's a little. For the people who don't know, there's a little icon in the rule set. It's like a little stage with it with a cross through it yeah. that lets you know there's no hazard zone. Oh, so oh, if you're ever unsure, you can check. Yeah. It's not like it's um, a huge problem. It's just nothing to check. Yeah. Like you check your name before pause on you or off. Set. Pause you know? on or off. Which is not part of the rule set, which is kind of yeah. useful when except for when it's not off. All right, down throw. And you saw it earlier. Okay. You saw Might not have been the best yet. Hitting it up with the uh, dark, the dark aura, you know, the up, uh, up throw into up B. To no avail, but I, I like to see that. Regardless. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah. All right. Oh my God, it's so hard to be able to kill the Shoryu's right. Uh, Shoryu's right. Oh sorry, not Shoryu. Shoryu's Shur right now. And fourth throw. Wow. Uh, yeah, the kill maybe? move now. Wow. Might, might have been DI for the down throw. Yeah. Fourth throws really fast. Because if you DI on down throw, that, even at that percent, you might still get up air. And A1, I want to build up what you said earlier. Um, a lot of the characters in this game, um, even though they might, their opponent might live to a high percent, it's not so much uh, weak kill power, it's just late kill power. Yeah. And that's a change they made a lot in Ultimate, where they can still get the kill, it just takes a while. Yeah, that's it's, what... It's not like, like, a, like a melee Marth or some character in Smash 4 that you live to 200, you got no kill throws, yeah. you got no kill moves. And then you're just at a loss. I think, that, I think that's what causes it to be a mix between past games like Melee and Smash 4, where at the beginning you're going to get these combos that are insane that they're already 50, and it looks like a really fast game, but then later on you get something more similar to Smash 4, right? Where you're trying to find this kill and a single kill option. You're alive, don't worry. Yeah, 100%. I was about to say. All right. Even game so far, but nice. the combo coming in. Combo to side be off the fair. Oh, I like the awareness to just kind of bait him in and go for the dare. And he didn't even actually get properly punished for it because of the bat within. He had a high recovery as well. Wow, that was like a really should good have, option coverage. Should have done the, the dip down and then go up, uh, up B. Yeah, I think that would be harder. I don't go. think Timmy can do anything down there no, that I would don't kill. Think so. He can hit you, he can nair. He might have had to read it with a back air, but it wouldn't have been as free. For sure. I agree. Yeah, a lot of lag after extending there, but again, no and punish. This doesn't look like the same JW we saw against Blacksmith, I gotta say. Yeah. He seems like he's not as not as confident in his options. Which is Ooh. weird, because he was he really liked the Bayonetta matchup. Definitely confident forward. there with the down smash. That's true. That's but true. I still agree with you. I feel like in terms of conf uh, how confident he wants to get bail, it was high. It was hundred percent high in Smash 4. And now it's a little bit different, you know? Maybe he's like uh giving too much respect to Jimmy. Or maybe Mistake just knows him a little too well. Even uh, in a new game. Definitely Ooh. scary. All right, Nair, no punish. Goes for the grab. I imagine since he drops shield 11 frames, baby. It's even harder than before. Man, if you all just follow the rules. It's Hazard, Smashville, and we wouldn't have this platform captain right now. That's we all I'm saying. Well, we might. We might have. Just off the stage. Yeah, it would yeah. for a couple seconds. And then, true. Yeah. and then back to the middle. All right. Wow. 
And that's the one thing. Wow. Uh, that was so anticlimactic. Afterburner kick is a pre patch angle now. It's 2016 uh, afterburner kick. It's, it's just less, a little less potent. It's just the angle that's similar yeah. to the Which pass. Which is a good change. Yeah. Because she can't kill anymore. It's not like she's got a zero to death with it. Okay, first hit of what? There? And I'm scared if I'm to meme. A down tilt up smash will take it. Good Ooh, tech at least. Very close. And if it has it on Smashville. Oh, no fear. Just went straight if through that, the platform. If it was Smashville Hazards on, I, he yeah. might have got that down to the <laughs> smash. I'm just saying. Um, yeah, that So, JW, if you're uh, against Hazard Smashville, uh, reconsider. I'll be honest, maybe Tamim knew. Maybe. Maybe Tamim knew. No, actually, no, because it was JW's counter pick. JW's the idiot. Never mind. Yeah, did they? I want to ask, yeah, but I, I, I don't ask them now. That's a surprise at this point. But, um, <laughs> yeah, wow, we're seeing uh, JW versus the JW Slayer. To be honest, I mean, you have the Lima Slayer. Uh, what's the hierarchy? Lima Slayer, and then what? Uh, JW Slayer. Well, JW Lima? Slayer, obviously. Yeah, and then what? Does that mean Lima's just last? He's just third. Lima's at the bottom. Wow, that sucks. Sorry, Lima. Sorry, Lima. <laughs> He's somewhere. probably watching because yeah. Timmy's here. I'm yeah, sorry, Lima. Sorry, You're Lima. not at the bottom. You're definitely not at the bottom. Actually, I haven't seen uh, Lima play besides Twitter. Do you know what yeah. I mean? I'm so looking forward to like. Let's make moves in Genesis Six. Oh, is he going to? I don't think he's going to let's make moves, okay. but I'm just saying in general because yeah. I really want to see high-level competitive play. Yeah, it's one thing yeah. to watch all the streams and like the local tournaments, but to see the the big, you know, grouping of yeah. every high-level and top-level competitive player yeah. duke it out against each other is, is a thrill you can't really match with smaller events. It's definitely yeah. a marvel to see. I mean, being here at a local, great. You know, there's like a homey atmosphere, but at a national. That's when the like, competitive juices start flowing. Mm -hmm. Gobble! <coughs> Sorry, this <there's something. coughs> uh, Yeah. Yeah. Um, uh, game sure. three here. I don't. Uh, when I watch JW interact with Bayonet the Live, I honestly don't know what it is that I'm expecting out of the uppies. Yeah. I mean, I understand it against uh, Black Twin. Uh, Black Twins, you know, against the Dark Pit. And then uh, Mufasa l later in uh, Top 24. But against Bayonetta, it's like. You know? I don't know the purpose of them. Yeah. Damage? Maybe he can get anything else. Yeah, really. He has a little squirt damage. Or keep him, keep to, to me off stage as long as possible. Honestly, I, I can respect that. All right, here we go. Oh, this is uh -oh. great, but does not oh, doesn't matter which twist. Alive? Yep. Definitely. And town uh, a much higher blast zone than it had in Smash Four. I think it's actually the highest of the legal stages. Yeah, I think. and I actually love that change. I think the sides are still relatively the same. But the ceiling is the highest of all legal stages right now. That's interesting. Yeah. That's pretty cool. A stage. Oh, but it doesn't matter how high you go, Sanim is going higher after that up smash. Good stuff to GW. You take the first stock. The game three. I think this might be the first league JW's had. I think yeah. so. At least the first stock oh. taken. And yeah. now that it's didn't stock. last long. Yeah. But uh, hopefully he can use the. No, he can't use the advantage stick that he had to do anything. A lot of heal slides, and he's out of range to be pun uh, to, to get the punish, and that's not really his fault per se. He just wanted to just get out of dodge, and assist the situation. So I don't blame him for it. Uh oh, he's got to gotta jump. I think he's yeah. fine. Yeah, there we go. At least had a chance to time a down smash at least, you know. So it was still in his favor, but All right. He's okay with camping. He's just standing he's not, in the corner. Yeah, to be honest, he's not that far away. It's not that big of a deficit where he's like he's gonna stop camping. But now, now you have to go in, man. Yeah, Tamim doesn't seem like the type of player to just throw away a lead. Also, Definitely not. Also, I love the fact that we went on hazard, hazard, hazardless Wait, smash yeah. And, and we're on Hazard's Town. No, it's it's they still transition, I think, with Hazard's Off. Oh, really? No, it's just, on Hazard's Off, it's actually just the, top, the middle platform that moves up and down. That's all the stage does. And the oh. two side platforms remain high. See, yeah. Okay, either wow. way. Uh, JW uh, cleans up that stock, though. Wow, yeah, okay. Third time's a charm? No way. No way. I, I I don't believe in that. He went for two F smashes, I think, in this set so far, and it worked, but the third one's not going to work. See how weak that's a noodle, but the side oh. the bullets you the told bullets. us yeah. you said it kills now. Yeah, the initial hit did. was it the uh, the, the yeah it was the initial hit. Okay, yeah, it's it, it's that is what actually a hammer. What world we bro. live in? We're up air at the top of the stage isn't gonna kill, and then bullets, bullets. from from the ledge <laughs> gonna take it. Yeah, bullet climax. That's insane. Sakurai's vicious. <laughs> All right, tries to extend the combo. That's why he actually did the landing hit of the last hit of fair, but nothing afterwards. Punish, but jab, okay. You know, I mean, it's 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 damage. I'm not gonna say anything. 
Plus, everyone's so used to shield grabbing, he probably just went for jab. Yeah. You know? Jabs are so annoying in this game. The fact that they auto link now is. I'm so used to just getting out of them. Thank God for Bat Within. God damn. Oh, Ooh, that's it. Oh. He could have shielded. He still had an upbeat. Yeah. He could have shielded, he shielded that. Shielded. I guess wasn't ready to react. All right. JW puts one on the board. Does not give a crap about Bats Within. Does not give a heck. A heck. About anything. Yeah. What if I just say crap? You know what I mean? Maybe that's just part of my vocal vocabulary. Maybe. You know? Maybe. Maybe I'm not actually trying to censor myself. You ever thought about that? Before you make fun of me like that, Blush? So insensitive, yeah. Blush. Come on. Oh, my bad, dude. My bad. <laughs> Every time you put the heat on Blush, he's like, uh, whatever. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> Either way, sorry, I mean, I time. hate you with a flaming passion. <laughs> <laughs> Get off this chair. Game four. Blush, while he's wilding out, these two are wilding out in the bracket. Inside. Why are we going back to town? I don't know. I feel like that's just something tamim has been doing. I think Tamim doesn't really care. I think he thinks he can beat JW on any stage. Yeah. There is a level to Tamim where he actually has belief that he can beat anyone, you know what I mean? And looking at Smash 4 and looking at even Ultimate, it's been proven. It's honestly been proven. I think everyone except MKLeo. Yeah. But MKLeo was a beast against Bayonetta. Yeah. And he has, a he has a pretty good record against Tweak, second best player in the world. It's really exactly. just MKLeo. Yeah. All right, that throw. JW has to be careful with these high up Bs. The ledge is still really good. Damn. Okay, does not get the actual heal where the strongest hit is, so he actually lives. But still, that's a that's a, a threat and a half. Then again, down tilt at fair, I imagine will kill by now. Oh, but that good okay, DI, no. got the DI. That high ceiling and good DI. That within, there we go. No reset. Do you think people still complain about bats within in this game? No. I, I imagine they can't. They can't. After what they happened to They literally can't, can't complain about Bat Within. Anymore. There can't be any more complaints about Bayo. Especially since there are times where Bat Within would actually be bad for the Bayo. It's back four. Yeah. So now imagine an ultimate. There we go. Oh. I s mm. Covering that option with forward air of all things. Yeah. Beyonce, he's been doing it a lot, actually. He gets the boss, he gets black tits. Any regular get up or anything. Anything just ledge requirement. He just does just, uh, full hop. Oh, no. Short hop. There. That's really it. Yeah. He's been... Getting a lot of mileage out of it. He's been hitting it very often. This man bounced off a balloon, and I bet he already knew. You know what I mean? After the afterburn kick, he's like, no, I'm going to get extra height. I'm going to tilt you a little bit by never coming down. And he only took 15%. And he's got a massive lead. Back on the plat. Man, Tamim is really slowing this down. He actually has no regard for any him? approach. He He's him? dead. He's dead, yeah. What? Finally. Yeah. Finally. Finally. He's gone so many sets. Finally a roof combo. <laughs> <laughs> On Town and City. It's Christmas. <laughs> we finally got one. Oh, man. He's content to stay in this corner. I guess, honestly, that's not a bad strategy against JW. He can react to a lot of the stuff he's trying to do. You can react to those awful up Bs to the center of the stage. Yeah, that's actually, the, to be fair, that's the first up B that no. was that awful. Oh, well, some of them are kind of bad. Yeah, some of but them are kind of bad. But this time, Tamim is ready to punch him. That's the difference. The other ones were bad, but Tamim wasn't ready. This yeah. time he was. Yeah, he didn't commit to anything. Just reacted. Oh, my. I don't know what GW can do, man. We. It's not that Tamim is being oppressive. It's more so that he's just being non-committal, and he legit just doesn't care. Like, yeah. what will you do? You know what I mean? I think if JW wins this game, he might have to bust out the DK. There we go. Not going to kill, though. Thank you, Town and City. I want to give a second to shout out my boy, KK Slider. Oh, yeah. Thank the you homie. for entertaining us during, during this oh, slow match. It's, yeah, it's slow because to me, knows, man. He does not have to commit or anything. He's probably tilting for JW. Yeah, super tilting. And you know what to me, he's, he's always thinking about? It. He's just listening to some good old KK Slider. Just jamming out. KK Western. Oh no, oh. man. See how far he got set. <laughs> he legit doesn't care. He doesn't care. <laughs> he doesn't care. Wow. <laughs> oh my god. People are like saying, yo, to me, in, in ultimate, it's, he's going to fall right. off. He's no fall bayonetta. Off. No bayonetta. You're carried. Yeah. But look at this. Look okay. at this. This is, this is looking like and Smash And this is a JW that just beat Black Wings. Damn.
This Kiss. isn't this isn't a JW that's washed up. Yeah, this is this Prime is. JW, and that's a 3 Oh, this is three one. Prime. He got a game. Three didn't. one. Sorry, yeah. sorry. Three one. Regardless, that that entire game wow. right there was a. The, the set was the ultimate. That set. was difficult. But that that game was a Smash Four game. That was a Smash Four game. Yep. God wow. damn. Good stuff to to Mimi. Truly the ultimate Smash game. There's pieces for every game from here. Yeah.